Alright, hey guys. Alright, so all right, we'll, we'll start. Let's pretend like we haven't filmed anything yet, and we'll start from now. Alright. Action. <laughs> So welcome back to my channel and uh, I don't know what part of the intro from earlier that I may or may not have used when it comes to the time we go and edit all this. So just in case, <laughs> I'm going to reintroduce Susanna to the channel. She's another vlogger. She's from Brisbane here and I did not even know that there was like other vloggers in Brisbane. Like, I've been trying to find either. someone and finally I found someone. I know. So yeah, so Susanna, um, just quickly introduce yourself to re just in case I don't use the other um, info um, from earlier because I don't know what I'm gonna do when it gets it comes time to editing. But um, just tell everyone what you do, um, what your channel is about, and stuff like that, so that my audience knows. And I will be putting a link in the description cool. so you guys check out Susanna's uh, channel. Um, oh, please subscribe, show her some love. I really appreciate it. She's super cool Aww. and really lovely person. So Me too. Aww. I'm blushing, but I'm black, so you can't tell. <laughs> All right. Hey guys. All right, so. All right, we'll, we'll start. Let's pretend like we haven't filmed anything yet, and we'll start from now. All right. Action. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, guys, this is crazy. Like, I didn't even. Okay, I didn't try to look at both cameras. <laughs> this is, yeah. we, we both got our vlogging cameras going only yes. for this part because yeah. we thought it'd be easier for the intro. But. For our mukbang, but I don't know. It actually, he's probably kind of cray cray. So, <laughs> all right. So, you, how about you introduce yourself to hey, everyone? This is, what do I usually introduce myself as? <laughs> <laughs> oh God, this is fun. I'm so, so, Only oh you can answer that question. By yes. Way. Uh, yes. Hey everyone, welcome. That's usually how I introduce Okay, cool, myself. okay. <laughs> I really should think of an intro. Okay, but you, you, you should also, just because my audience don't know who you are, mm -hmm. so maybe tell them who you are as well. Hey, I'm Susanna. <laughs> I'm a vlogger. <laughs> yeah, and you guys over over there on this camera, our audience, I'm Faith. Um, gotta have faith. And... Um, this is crazy. I'm like super excited to be here um, because we have not actually ever filmed or met yet. Like my hands are really dry too. I should put some lotion on, but I'll just keep my hands in because now you can see. <laughs> hey guys, um, welcome to another vlog, and I'm here with the awesome Susanna. She is another vlogger from Brisbane, which I didn't Guess even know existed. Guess how we met. Guess how we met. How did we meet? Wait, no. Let's not let's 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 not tell people how we met. Yeah. Let's let's keep that uh, uh, yes. uh, on the deal. Yeah, that would be we, we gotta keep some mystery here. Yes. <laughs> but um, I don't know. Actually, you know what? I think personally, like, and you can feel free to use that intro footage if you want or yeah. whatever like I don't know I'm actually thinking what I'm because this guy this so you know if this seems so random and weird it's like because <laughs> we have never done a vlog with another vlogger yes. so we're kind of like uh okay um will you go and then I'll go or or yeah how about we I, I don't know like let's have both right now we have both of our, our cameras filming and it's like yeah, I gotta remember to look at each other's lens. Yes. <laughs> so what we're gonna do, guys, just so you know, 
is we're going to actually stop one of our cameras and because we was only going to introduce like for the mukbang so we're doing the mukbang this is a corn chip mukbang we love corn chips and these particular ones are el toras which you, if you watch one of my old vlogs you'd know my love with el toras is real now this is an audi corn chip that actually tastes like doritos so anyways they're really dope yeah and i love them i'm an el tora fan now so we're doing a mukbang We've got our American drinks, drinks from back home that are very popular. Cheers. <laughs> Root beer, can of dry ginger ale, you guys know how we roll. And so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn my camera off and I'm going to go over and focus solely on her camera so that she can get great content for her channel, ask me whatever questions, talk about whatever she wants to talk about. And then I'm going to come back to my camera and <laughs> then I'm going to do the same. And that way, I can make sure that I'm giving everyone, audience, yes. Yes. full eye contact and it's not really weird, so. Awesome. <laughs> so, I mean, I mean, the other option is that we could technically set the cameras up like on different angles yeah. and we could share footage right. and then you can edit yours your way and I could edit mine my way, which is actually probably a good idea as well, but yeah. I guess, I don't, I don't know, like if our if our dialogue that are speaking is exactly the same, That's right. then that could be a problem with YouTube. I don't yeah. even know these answers to these I questions. So, There's so, so many mysteries. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to do that, guys. I'll be back on my camera in a sec. Peace out. actually uh, one is just vlogging like I haven't actually decided what to do with two, two channels if I should combine them or keep them separate um, one is like vlogging yeah and the other one is um, vlogs as well I guess okay uh, no but uh... <laughs> actually, I was not farting I was actually <laughs> Trying to, I'm looking at the lens and I'm like, you know what? I'm, I could have probably centered myself a bit, but made this <laughs> balance better. I don't know. I'm being a bit of a perfectionist, but anyways, continue. <laughs> I gotta think about what my channel is about because there's like everything. Like there's a just like things that I'm interested in, like things like I like to try to put some kind of like motivational things if I can, yeah. and I also love to show like things that I buy. Sure, sure. Yeah, and. Um, just vlogs, day-to-day -day things, just, yeah, things like that. Yeah, and it sounds very similar like my channel, like her channel, I'm, I'm the same way. Like, yes, like my, my channel is a little bit of everything. Yeah. And I kind of, I kind of really prefer that. Like, I like mm -hmm. having a bit of variety, like, because yes. that's kind of person I am. Like, yes. um, yeah, it's my like, audience. If I just stick to one thing, yeah. it just feels too limited, and I, soon I'll be like trying to think of what, New things I can do because yeah. I'd be bored of this one. So yeah. sure, sure. And I, and I think like um, one one cool thing for me though is like I do have so many different interests and yes, things I'm passionate exactly. about. So I am able to then present that to my audience. And, yeah. And so. I like my channel to be a reflection of who I am as a person, that's and it, I am a one of those kind of people who who yeah. loves to do tons of things. Yeah, and I think like if um, people are watching, I really think that because I love watching all your content. I oh, thank you. <laughs> I, I really don't mind if it's um, at the restaurant or out and about or like even like I just find it really interesting. I, I love the things you say, and I think that's thank what you. other people will find too. Thank you very much. I appreciate the kudos, and um, there's so many other things too that I'm going to do in my channel. Yeah, I, I'm really excited. I, I'm going to do some car builds, even like I love cars and motorcycles and things cool. like that. So I'm going to do some car stuff, um, music stuff, of course, because of my yeah. music background. So a lot of that's going to happen, and um, I, I, I also like tech. Yeah, like, cameras and nice. and you know phones and gadgets and just whatever so I'm yeah. gonna have a lot more stuff like that you can come on and do some reviews with me cool yeah yeah we have the same camera <laughs> so but um like I think really um one thing that really excites me about 
um, all of the stuff that we do is that we are able to, no matter what we do on our channel, we're able to give um, audiences connect with them yeah. and and yeah. share a part of our lives. Like I mean, it's, it's actually I don't know about you. Do you find it a bit? Um, overwhelming to to the fact that there's actually people who want to watch your life and yeah, see what yeah. you have to it's say. Like, like, yeah, it is. It's like, oh my god, I'm getting nervous. <laughs> like, I, um, it's funny because when I go out and meet people, I don't really tell them about the vlogging, but like, yeah, so. Because it's so weird to think that these people who know me might watch. Yeah, something that I film because I'm usually very different when I'm filming versus when I just talk to people. Yeah, sure. But right now, I think I'm like acting more like how I usually would. Mm. But that's because I feel like I know you because <laughs> when I, I watched your video. It's just uh, like so awesome. <laughs> thanks, thanks, thanks. <laughs> but if it was someone I didn't know, I would just be really quiet and like not say much. And yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think that's one really cool thing as well. Like you mentioned, like when you. Um, because of YouTube and yeah. because you're able to go and watch people's lives, yeah. even when you don't know them, you feel like you know them yeah. because you're yeah. watching them yes. every you day. See, yeah, you see how they talk, you see yeah. their values and things like that. It's so interesting. And that's true, like, especially values. I, yeah. I only, I don't know, like, I, I don't know, that's, maybe that's not exactly, because there's probably a few people's channels I've subscribed to that I'm not really, yeah, yeah. I would never do the things they're yeah, doing, but it's, but it's entertaining, so I kind of watch exactly. it, you know, like, yeah. for example, there's this one channel, and there's this guy, and he, um, he goes, he goes, like, scuba diving and, and stuff, like, really deep waters and wow. tries to find stuff, which is cool, like, yeah. it's, it's cool to watch, and, but realistically, it's not something I would ever do. Yeah, exactly. In a million years, like you would not ever catch me yeah, doing that. Exactly. You know? So yes, I think that's maybe one of the cool yeah, things. Yeah. I guess you get to live through someone else's yes, ex exactly. life experiences as well, which is pretty cool. Like, yeah. I, guys, I'm so excited today because, like, I've been. We were actually supposed to meet on Monday, and yes. and then things didn't work out, and then so we're here today. Um, by the way, it's Thursday when filming this, so I am going to do my best to get this video out tonight oh, so wow. it's still fresh on Thursday. Oh. So that's my goal for the day. Wow. Um, I'm, but, so, I'm such a slow editor. I'm pulling me out like my next <laughs> Oh, God. My audience knows this about me, too. Like, I'm actually, I, I switched and started doing daily vlogging. Wow. And I wasn't doing daily at first. Like, I was doing, like, you know, one maybe two a week if oh, i got lucky yeah. but that's it was mainly cool. like me like once a week kind right. of thing that's a i didn't have a schedule yeah. and and then i was i decided to make the switch to being a daily vlogger wow. and in reality i was like i mean my time right now is so already non-existent <laughs> like how am i going to pull this off but i really wanted to do it so i've been yeah. trying to make this work and fit it into my my busy lifestyle yeah and it's been <laughs> kind of a fail. Like I, I filmed tons of stuff. Like every day I'm filming. Yes. But yes, yes. then finding the time to edit is just where it takes. Because guys, if you don't know, it takes like, actually a long time to, edit. to yeah. if you want to do a really nice edit on your yes. your videos and things. Exactly. Like it takes a bit of time. Like you know, you can't just do it in two seconds. Yeah, you, you know? gotta just like throw it all together. Yeah. And then, yeah. Go ahead. Because <laughs> sometimes you find like things that like parts that you film that you don't need you're gonna cut yeah. out and then yeah yeah and, and the other thing is like once you've done all that the other reason why it takes a while to get the vlog to you guys is because like once we edit it you, you depending on how long your video is then oh, it has yes. to render yes. and the worst part after the rendering and depending what you're doing in your rendering as well because like if you're trying to denoise it if you've got noise and you're using like a denoiser Rendering takes literally. It can take days, guys. Literally, like it can take so long. Um, and the it, wait is insane. Yeah. I feel like the time's going so slow while it's rendering. So yeah. all I want to see is what I want to watch what I've filmed, and it and, won't come out. And uh, <clears throat> ginger ale, guys. Ginger ale, root beer. By the way, 
But the longest thing is the upload. Yes. Oh. Yes. The upload is yes. ridiculous. It is. Yeah, upload speed is really slow. Yeah. And um, whenever I upload, I download honey, my internet goes really slow. Mm. Yeah, so like we um we do our best. I think yeah. that's where the reality is and some things are out of our control. Yeah. I have like so many videos backlog that oh. I haven't even <laughs> There's just <laughs> clips in my camera. <laughs> Don't get me thinking about it. Like, I, I actually have some really good content that I want to get out there. And um, so, I mean, I, I think it's just a matter of, of um, being able to to get into a routine. Yes. And, yes. and figure out how to just consistently stick to that routine. Yeah. It's still hard for me. Because unexpected yeah. things happen every exactly. day. Exactly. Yeah, and sometimes you do, you start something else and then you, you find like you're spending a lot of time doing that and yeah. then you're, oh, what do I do? Yeah, <laughs> That's yeah, happened so. to me a lot. But, um, like, how long, so how long have you been vlogging for now? Uh, I started really at the beginning of this year. Okay. Well, at the end of last year, I should say. Yeah. Yeah, like December last year. So, uh, you it's probably been like... Seven months? Yeah. yeah. Too long. Before, I was one of those people who forever wanted to vlog but was too nervous, too scared and right. stuff. And I was just putting it off forever. And then one day I thought, you know what? I'm just going to make this happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I, I actually um, started in May. Wow. So, and I'm actually quite, like, that being said, guys, and like, Suzanne, you've seen my channel, so you yeah. know, I already have 40 videos that up here. Since May. Amazing. So I have, even though I've been missing days here and there, like I think guys have done a pretty freaking good job. Yeah. Like, to already have 40 videos up there and like, especially when I'm still juggling everything else. Like I, I feel really proud of that accomplishment. Yeah, absolutely. Um, it's amazing because you have the restaurant which runs till really late and wow. The restaurant and then bowling and then training and working out and yeah. and doing my personal development stuff and, and putting on like I'm going to put on a seminar and a workshop wow. like doing that stuff again I used to do that stuff quite often wow. and then I'm also um, getting ready to go in the studio and record some new music and things like that cool. and, and then there's all the filming and editing like I yeah. outside of the vlogs I have other film projects like wow. some um, movies and things like that oh, that I, I love the yeah, that. yeah got all kinds of different projects going on yeah, so. yeah but the way I see it like to me like and, and I, I think this is the most important reason why I do what I do and try to get as much into every single moment that I can is because I do believe in the moment I believe yes. the moment that's is so one important. thing I really love what you said it was just so great and you gotta live your life and not put off tomorrow what you can yeah. do today because Life is un, full of uncertainties, exactly. and it's short. You know, as, as, as much as we want to believe that we have an endless amount of time, that's right. we actually really don't. Yeah, because that's actually how I was like last year. I kept thinking like, by next year, I will, I will, and I realized that oh, it's like next year came and I still haven't done anything. Mm -hmm. I'm really gonna start. You're gonna start right now, and like just do what you want to do right now rather than wait till tomorrow yeah yeah, yeah. but you know like I think that's the problem mm -hmm. with so many people is mm -hmm. they, they keep putting off things yeah. until tomorrow until yes. tomorrow until tomorrow yes. and that's that one video I did um, I think it was the pursuit of happiness yes, yes I love that yeah one. and that was about that like yes. it's, it's really just people forget to live now right yes and yeah. then what happens you keep putting something off and then something unexpected happens yeah, and you didn't exactly. get to do it anyways yes, exactly. so you, you did all of that putting off for nothing that's like, right yeah. and, and guys and by the way I, i've been meaning to say this as well like that doesn't mean that you shouldn't have goals or right, dreams exactly. or things you want to achieve like that's that's cool like it's i'm not saying don't do that yeah. i'm not saying don't plan for a trip somewhere or something like I'm just saying in the process of doing all these things that you think are really going to make you happy yeah don't forget to find happiness now in the moment and don't forget to live now in this moment and you know because otherwise 
when are you going to live? You're gonna you're gonna start living in two years. Is yeah. that your plan? Exactly. You know. Yeah. So that's, that's kind of thing. Right. But um, how do you find the vlogging thing for you? Like, do you have you found it to be um, more like difficult than you thought it would be to grow your channel and things like that? Or uh, well, I I think it's been more fun and easier than I thought the actual filming and the editing. Yeah. I used to think, oh my god, what am I gonna do? Mm. <laughs> it's so hard. I found that easy, so yeah, and it's been really fun. Like I, I've met some really nice people in you. Yeah, no, well, thank yeah, you. Yeah, like, yeah, so thanks to vlogging. Mm. <laughs> I think though, like, it's interesting that you say, uh, like, yeah, I mean, I, I find this to be so cool to be able to find another content creator that yes, I can yeah. talk to you and and just um, you know bring some different variety to exactly. my channel and stuff yeah. and thoughts and insight and things. But like I came from a video like a film background, like you know I've I've, I've, I've been into video and all this stuff for a long time. Yeah. But when I started vlogging, it actually just really it was a whole different thing. You know yeah. what I mean? Like it was a whole. The, the level of, because usually when I do my other projects, like I don't have to have it ready by the next day. Right. You know, like I give myself time to try to finish things. Right. Like I don't like to rush things. Mm -hmm. But now it's like you do a vlog and you like the, the heat is on, the pressure is on to come up with, not only to come up with good content oh, or a yeah. great idea yeah. or a great concept, but something that you haven't done yet as well. Yeah. You gotta try to do something different. Yeah. And then, on top of all of that, you have to then go, okay, and then I have to go back and edit all this. <laughs> yes. And yeah. I have to put this out by tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's, it's a bit hectic, it's a bit yeah. crazy. Yeah. But I love it. Me too. I we wouldn't it. be doing it if we didn't love it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because it's fun. Like, that's why I we do it, because it's fun. It's, um,. It's more fun than I thought it would. It's actually yeah. kind of becomes like an addiction. Or exactly. That's what I feel like. Mm. It's like it, it seems like an insane amount of work. Like mm. you have to edit all the stuff, but when you love it, it feels like you're doing it to relax, and it's just mm. really nice. That's that's life, yeah. you know. Like exactly. in general, like when you, when you're doing something that you you really enjoy, that you love doing, that you're passionate about, yeah. it never feels like work. Exactly. So I love that. That's yeah. a good point. And that's something I would like want everyone to like have their life to be like not just doing boring things that they hate doing every day, but yeah. doing stuff that they enjoy. Exactly. Absolutely. So Suzanne, like, okay, you're. So you told me you're married. Okay, this is. Uh, <laughs> this is <laughs> so yeah, well, so, um, so she has I, an interesting story, yeah, guys. I do, actually. <laughs> So, I, share, I, share your story with my audience. Yes. I was married um, about, God, like, how many years ago? <laughs> no, I met, uh, at that time, I met um, someone online, and then I went to meet him, and I, um, we got married. And a couple of years later, I found that he was transgender, and uh, that <clears throat> he wanted to become a girl. So, yeah, uh, we decided to s stay together, we didn't decide to split, uh, and we came to Australia, had a baby. Oh, wow. Yeah, well, the baby was through IVF, of course, because um, I was about to say technical difficulties. <laughs> ah, yes, but... Um, <laughs> So we have a little boy who's uh, like three and a half. He is so cute. Aww. He likes to scare me half to death. Oh wow! All the time, by like, finding everything that he could find. But we just we're we're really happy, you know. We we yeah. It's, the relationship is different. From yeah, what it used to be. Well, like, yeah, obviously well, yeah. <laughs> it's a little bit different like, <laughs> than yeah. it used to be, guys. Yeah. Or, but, know, like, but they're the same person. Yeah. On, yeah. yeah nothing's thinking. changed on the, the yeah. out. You know, the thing that matters the most is what's on the inside. Yes. Exactly. 
that. Look. So outwardly, even if they decided to get a bunch of tattoos to make themselves look like a tiger, yeah. which there's a person who's done it, like they really? tattooed oh themselves to look like a tiger. Oh my god! And they they've done like all these plastic surgery, even with their wow. ears and stuff. It's oh on Guinness. I think it's like oh I god. think I saw it on Guinness Book of um, Ripley's Believe It or Not, or one of those type of shows that used to come on. But yeah, someone's done that extreme. But my point is, is that. The only thing that should really matter was on the inside. Yes. So, yes. so that's good that you oh, stood yeah. by your yeah. your girlfriend. Yeah. Because now you're a lesbian. Yeah. So <laughs> like, oh. she started out. She was she wasn't expecting to become a lesbian, yes. but were you? You weren't expecting no, that, right? You, no. When you first met him, you didn't know that. No, I didn't so, know at all. Yeah. I was completely um. Yeah. So, hey, oh. surprise! Hey, surprise! <laughs> surprise! You're a lesbian now. Yeah. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> so how do you, how do you, okay, now this is one question I would like to ask about this now. The IVF process, because like myself, you know, like I am, it's no secret, I only love girls. Yeah. Girls are awesome. <clears throat> and okay. unfortunately, that means yeah, that you might it means have you got to do IVF that. or some of you can have kids and things okay, like that. So, so. But did you find that process, and there's a lot of people out there, it doesn't matter if you're a lesbian or if you're, you're straight or blah, blah, blah. This topic is about now how yeah. hard is it to go through the process and how much and costly because i heard it's okay. really expensive as well the cost is actually probably the worst part yeah. because it will be like at least ten thousand dollars you would have to have that uh you do get some back but because we also had to do like operation to find certain things um that costs more but mm -hmm. if you're just doing it with donor then you would need at least ten thousand dollars you do get like five thousand back or oh wow so yeah, the government medicare, gives you some yeah, back medicare does give you that's like cool. a portion of that back but you need to have it you know to start with um, by the way that's that's only in australia i, I don't think yeah. our government gives money but yeah. i don't know though yeah, i could be wrong yeah. so i don't know um uh, yeah yeah so in australia you do get some back you guys are spoiled you do know that right? it's like cheese. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like I had a baby, went through the whole cesarean, and went out with ten dollars worth of painkillers. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So, um, okay. So the process itself is pretty fast. The only thing that you really got to do is wake up at five a.m. because the doctor wants you to go to his office at the crack of dawn to get tests done. And no. Wow. Yeah, a blood test will be second nature. You wouldn't even flinch anymore. And you have to get shots. Well, I couldn't do it to myself, so I had to get someone else to do it for me. You have to get a shot in the morning, shot in the evening, and wow. Yeah. So, but it was pretty. So it was a pretty yeah. straightforward process. Yeah. The process itself is not at all like scary. The worst part was the waiting, the unsure, uncertainty, yeah. like whether it's going to work or not. Because yeah. if it doesn't, then you lost like ten thousand uh. dollars. You don't get it back. And like, so it, that's the worst part is that you don't know whether it's going to work or not and you have to wait a long time. Sure. And um, now do you, do you find that in terms of um, your, your son, is it son or daughter? Son. Sorry, yes, yeah, son. So son. your son, um, is, your, is your son old enough to know what's happened to their dad? No, not really. he doesn't. Okay. He, he That's probably makes it easier. Yeah, then. yeah. He hasn't talked yet. Okay. Was <laughs> right. waiting for him to say his first photo? Oh, really? Okay. He's three and a half. Three and he has, half. has not talked yet. Well, we do send him to like daycare and like you know like a learning place. Yeah. But he has a lot of exposure to people talking, and we talk to him all the time. But I, I just think he's not going to talk until he knows he can do it. Sure. Or something. That sure. seems like how he is. So, um, so yeah, he's just. Sounds cute. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'll, I'll probably share a video so you can, you know, okay. share a photo or something. Oh, so that'd be cool. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like, yes. Everyone is probably now wondering how cute this little baby <laughs> yeah. is. Yeah. Oh, he was so cute. And <laughs> we loved him like he was ever. Like, we never thought, oh, like, like at first you might think, oh, how does it feel using like a donor? You don't even know the person. But, you know, when you see the baby, it's just so cute. No. You know, it's like, like you don't even think, oh, this is someone else, you know. Yeah. You're just very grateful that people donate. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. absolutely. Are you worried about though, like in the future, like the don't the person who's 
donated the sperm, are they able to find out um, any information? I think, or? I think only my son can like mm. get information after he's 18. Okay, yeah. So yeah. So it'd be up to him yeah, if he wants I think to reach so. out. I, I, yeah, it would be really interesting for the donor. Yeah, I've got like 3,000 kids. <laughs> wow. That'd be weird. Yeah, that would be. Um, <laughs> yeah. I don't even know. Yeah, that, that's just a really weird thought. Like, when I have all these <laughs> kids out there that you don't even know. I think there was a, a movie. Yeah, like I think I yeah, heard of that. I can't remember it, but I kind of vaguely remember it. <laughs> what? Owen Wilson, maybe? Was I can't remember. I, can't, the I think yeah. maybe. I can't remember. But um, okay. So in your in your um, okay. So we know about your your daily life now, your family life, which is pretty interesting. Um, so what what else do you do? You work like do you vlog and work during the day? I don't work? work at the moment, mm -hmm. mainly because of the my son's still like yeah. young, so I. So you're just 100% yeah, looking after your yeah, kid. Yeah, sure. he, that makes sense. Yeah, he gets really upset if he comes home and I'm not there. Aww. <laughs> he, 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 before he leaves, I have to sit on the couch so that, you know. <laughs> so, yeah. Aww. Well, he misses his mommy, Aww. so. That's yeah, cool. so I try to give him a lot of time in the evening when he gets, gets back. So, yeah. yeah. So, okay. Is there anything, like, advice wise that because as a fellow content creator mm -hmm. and you've actually been doing it, even though our channels are both pretty new yeah. you technically are the senior to me you've done it a bit longer because your channel is longer so oh. so do you have anything that not just for me but maybe someone else who's just started out a channel that some really good advice to give us in terms of getting the most from our channel or getting more subscribers or likes or or anything any tips or anything that you want to share I think uh, the most important thing is staying motivated because for me I've always had challenges with staying motivation uh, this is a funny thing that me and my friend one time we decided to we could uh, start a course on motivation okay. and we never got motivated enough to start <laughs> yeah, that's something you would see in like a comedy thing or something <laughs> yeah, that's actually <laughs> pretty crazy. Um, that would be a great movie. Yeah, it would. It was like, I might have to pinch that idea. Yes, do, do it. I would love to see it. Yes. <laughs> so, um, for me, it's always like if you're motivated, you're gonna create content, and that's how you're gonna, um, you know, grow. And yeah. if you just do it for like three weeks and you stop for like three months, then you're probably not going to get... So you have to be consistent. consistent. Yeah, consistent. Yeah. And to find what makes you motivated is really important. Yeah. Because if you, like, in the past I've done like, like, crazy amount of things within like three months. And then I just got so burned out and yeah. tired that I just quit. And then it's like, it was nowhere near as good as people who were just doing consistently over time. Yeah, so, sure. Yeah, I, I find that that's really important is to stay motivated or I you know what when you find that you're losing motivation go watch Faith no. because she is so motivating thank you thank <laughs> that's you what that. I like you really motivated me with the videos too I was all like in a slump thinking like I just can't be bothered and then I watched your videos like I'm gonna get started again I think so. that's the, that's why this is so important meeting mm. another yes. content creator, yeah. especially here in Australia. Yes. Where, yes. where you know, like back home in the States, we've got tons of people yeah. vlogging and it's yeah. easy to find where all the yeah. other vloggers are kind of yes. hanging out even because yes. like they go to all the big events and right. different things yeah. that are going on. But in this tiny little well, yeah. it's not tiny, but you know, it feels like there's nobody around that. It does. Yeah. I and I and I, I'm like I'm super excited about this and I can't wait to see what other adventures yeah. we do, guys. Yeah. So totally make idea. sure you stay um, tuned in to both of our channels. Oh, yeah. um, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Like I said, I will put the link in the description. And guys, I'm going to say thank you to Susanna oh, for coming. Thank you. For and me. much it's love so to you. Fun. And I'm gonna I'm gonna cut this vlog off because <laughs> I want to save something for next time. Yes. <laughs> 
So, guys, thank you so much for watching another vlog. I really appreciate the support. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you smash that like button. And also, you gotta click that notification bell because yeah. these days, if you don't click it, you might miss out on the upload. That's right. 